guys, it's Queen Ninja, and in today's video, I'll be reacting to Rain to episode 53 of I Cut Two Friends. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Ugh. I literally wish I knew that this came out on Tuesday, but I'm sitting here thinking, like, okay, it was Sunday of last week, and I didn't see it all day Sunday, and typically sometimes 50 out of 50. The episode may come out on Sunday or either Monday. Tuesday, I never freaking checked. And, like, it's now Saturday. 54 is already out. And it's probably going to be out either tomorrow or Tuesday. So I now have to make sure every single, like, Sunday, Tuesday. Still an answer. I mean, she's got to at least tell her before it's time, but I feel like it's going to be a while. I mean, it's only 53 going on 54. So maybe by episode 60? Still also wondering who's going to get their drilling desk next. I don't think anybody in this episode is going to get one. Maybe in the following episode. Because this is supposed to focus a little bit on Aine, I think. <laughs> Hibiki Showtime. Okay, no, then it's just gonna be focusing on Hibiki this week with a tiny bit of Aine. Oh, like, mm hmm like Oprah, and then instead of you, uh, them coming to you, you going to them. That's smart. Yeah. Mm hmm Dude, look at her style. It's so nice. Okay. Huh? 
spam. Mama. Five years. Excuse me. But not today. What the hell? Oh my god. So what's your name? Oh my god. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Of course, Neo would want to.
penguin outfit. That's so cute. Maybe when the series is over, Miguel can go. Which is a really smart way to do that. <laughs> of course. Ah, <laughs> uh, excuse me. Honestly, I think that makes her miss Alicia even more. He be funny. Well, I mean, it's just, this is the time that hopefully that when Alicia does want to reform her friends unit with Hibiki, they get to start all over again and then re-end of, um, not end of other way, um, introduce themselves to each other and learn new and better things about them.
-hmm. It takes time. Please respond. That's a good question, though. Well, I mean, Hibiki, you can't just say, okay, I immediately want to form friends again. You kind of have to, like, do baby steps with Alicia Hibiki. Say the exact thing, thing over and over again. She's going to eventually get tired of it because of the fact is that you took a message that was completely different, out of the blue, and not like the other. She officially finally responded. So if you continuously do that, then maybe, possibly, like, in the next few weeks, she will maybe say, hey, I want to come see you. She's gonna watch it. Aww. Like, if she does not come see her next week, we're gonna have a problem. It would make zero freaking sense if she just watches this and she's like, no, I'm not going. I'm like, then what was it for? You know, honestly, I thought they were going to use their friend's dress, but no, it's okay. And it makes you wonder if they're going to bring that back. I mean, like, if you look in the freaking opening, freaking Let Me Tear got it. They still got it. So, possibly it? <laughs> You know, one thing I did forget to say, I think after, uh, between episode 51 and 52, the animation is a lot, like, clearer if you compare it to season one's, but it's just so pretty. It's just more, like, enhanced and prettier. It's just every year they just, com like, not compare, enhance it. And it just, it makes it look even better. And it makes me wonder if this show is going to have maybe the same length of either OG Atatsu or Stars, like if we're going to see, because they always there's like a certain part, and it's usually either by the 25th episode or even the 50th episode of season one, and they go on to season two, the same thing, eventually where they enhance a lot of things. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mm-hmm. 
Alicia, do you want to come back? Even though we're going to Hebe Hebe? You go. I know, oh my God, that's so freaking sweet. I'm proud of her. I mean, it's just it's gonna take baby steps, honestly. But I think in the next few weeks, preferably either 60, 61, 62, 63, she's coming. We all know Alicia is coming. It, it, it's like right now we're in the calm before the storm like the next few episodes and then eventually when she decides to come that's when the storm is coming and i think it's gonna be really good to see these two officially come back together and make up and eventually perform together and i mean they're gonna be up there like honestly with love me tear because i eventually want to see what like they had to do a song that they performed during the friends cup that basically made them lose against Love Me Tear. And I still want them to do a flashback episode about that. But it really depends on, like, Bandai and what they're currently going to do with this season. And 50% 50, 50 of me, 50 of 50, like, half of me says they're going to do it. But then in the second half, I'm like, no, I don't think they're going to do it. But I think if fans personally really want it, because just showing a picture of two people clouded in darkness and walking away to me and maybe to some of you I'm not 100% sure it, it's not a lot of closure so sometimes you need to have an episode to say hey let me go back and let's go back like a year before me you I name Micah Emma Sakuya and Kaguya everyone and see what the heck happened how everything all transpired I think I know what it is. I, th I think I need going to get her, um, her gem. It, it has to be because if it's in her hair and then eventually she's going to take it out, it's going to be her, um, not princess cut, but regular old diamond cut of the freaking, uh, gem. So officially it's now kind of confirming it that I is going to be the second one. And I like, so now my theory isn't right. How I had two different theories. One where it was going to go, by each friends or which is gonna go random so it's going by friends so if pure palette is first it might go pure palette honey cat and um i forgot saki and kaki is one Wh whatever the name because like it, it's it's in my head but i don't remember it right now but it might be them last but then i don't know no and then, like, of course, in the opening, Love Me Tear has one. So, eventually, we're going to have to see theirs before the end of the series. And I'm guessing that's going to be, like, episode 100, which is a long, long time away. But, like, anything going to happen between this week's and next week's. I'm hoping that with next week's episode, or really this week's episode, when it comes out on Tuesday, um, or even tomorrow, that we get to see, like, a little more of Alicia's and Hibiki's friendship and their relationship. And to see what else happened that night. Like, okay, are you guys continuing still talking now? Has she officially... Are you calling each other, like, on the get-go? Um, 
to learn more about each other. Like, I know you have questions for Hebe, I mean, uh, Alicia, but does Alicia have questions for you? Like, you're learning more and new things about each other. So, of course, they're going to have to have friends, um, and not friends, um, questions for them because they're, um, their friends unit is like a relationship. They're kind of really in a relationship. That's the thing. Not like, um, it's the difference between friendships and relationships. They're together. Like, I know a lot of people probably ship, um, Hibiki and Alicia together. Like, how many people ship Aine and Mio together. That's what it really is. It's just a, a relationship between them and the love that they both have for one another and just trying to get it to that next level. So I'm just hoping that when 54 comes out, possibly between Sunday when this comes out or Monday or Tuesday, that we do get an answer because I don't want weeks to go by and which 50 out of 50, Aikatsu does do that, um, where several weeks go by and we never really got an answer from a specific episode. And then several, like I said, several weeks can go by and then finally we get our answer. But I just want them to kind of learn from what they did with stars and OG Aikatsu instead of waiting two, three, four, five, six, seven episodes um, about questions I have for a specific character or couples that we get the following episode, the answers for the following episode, either one to two weeks later. Because, like, I think I had a question on, um, what was her name? Uh, Akko. Yeah, I had a question about Akko. Um, during season two, and I didn't get it answered until the following Akko episode, and Akko barely had any episodes focused on her, and that was, like, I think maybe really because I don't want to say it was the fandom's fault on that. I really kind of want to blame that more on Bandai. I think because of the fact is they looked at who, um, fans thought was, like, very important, very likable, and then the ones that weren't as much likable as others, they got they weren't in the show as limited um, as much as they were. Because, like, in season one, uh, when Akatsu, um, Akatsu Sarge came out, Akko was kind of in, like, every episode. Maybe she didn't have a speaking role, but she was in the background or something. And then when season two came out and we introduced girls from Venus arc, it was like Akko and anyone else who wasn't important got pushed to the back burner. And it was just like, okay, they're going to have, like one or two, maybe four episodes in the entire series about them. And that's what I'm still kind of hoping that they don't do with this season. And they're not. I mean, we're only... Um, 51, 52, but yeah, about like four weeks into this season. So I can't really guess it. But I think when we get like 20 episodes, then maybe we'll we'll find out about that. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 53 of my Cutsy Friends. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Mattress Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next time, possibly even on Sunday, when this episode comes out, Monday, maybe Tuesday, for episode 54. Bye, guys.